Hey, what's up, guys? Malt here, and I... Wait, who's this? Oh, here's where you went. Good work today. If you want, I can fly you back up to the mountain. Oh! Sure, yeah! Sure, I appreciate that. Oh, this is, um, this is the robot girl, right? Thanks. Do you want me to fly you down the mountain? No. Cool, okay, so that means I saved a lot of time. I thought I had to walk up all the way again, but... Okay, so we didn't have to actually go up to the, up the mountain, so we were able to save a lot of time there. But, um, yeah, so right now we are going to go see what she wanted me... Or maybe she won't even tell me what it was, but I, got, I picked up something for Claire. And it was apparently very suspicious. Oh, look at that. Wow, you brought my you brought my stuff. Thanks so much. Sure thing. I'm assuming there these are ingredients for witchcraft. Yep, they sure are, and these are my especially hard to come by. What are these ingredients for this time? The Do doctor's tone really changed when I brought up the order. It's um the commission this time, it's a little um it's a is a little unpleasant. What is it? Just kidding, it's for healing potions. Witchcraft is used for more than just vile reasons like making poisons or curses. Though I guess I've taken taken on a few of those jo types of jobs before. Man, she's really pretty. If these uh, ingredients help people, why do they have to be obtained so sneakily? Um, the only uh, the only use for these types of unique items are formulas for relating to witchcraft. And ingredients like these tend to just have uses in more than just one formula. Some being very deadly or dangerous. To reduce the risk of these being used for some dangerous stuff, it's all just outlawed. Annoying, right? I guess I understand. Anyway, I have the ingredients now, but I don't have to, but I don't have to make the potions right away. Why don't I take you out for a flight on my broom? It always helps me feel better when I'm not doing too well. I'll be waiting for you outside. Broom flight. Where is broom? Why does she have so many brooms? So she could fly with them. Duh. Let me go save real quick. I can save here, right? Yeah, let's record stuff. No, let's not do it again. Alright, let's go. I wanna go on a flight. Hey, I wanna go on a flight? Go for a flight on my broom together? Yes. Alrighty, let's go. I didn't even say yes yet. Well, I did say yes. Technically, right? I said sure. Oh, shit. Man, I love all the art in this. Hee <laughs> isn't this nice? It is. Hey. You know, it's been a while since we've gone off anywhere together. Traveling, adventuring, and whatnot. Yeah, it has been. But it can't be helped. Things have been so busy lately. That's true. I love how their eyes, like her eye like closes when she's not talking, but then she opens it when she's talking and stuff. Like little details like that. It's really cool. I've gotten so many orders and clients lately, it's making my head spin. Mostly for wards and health potions, too. It seems like uh, something's really been stirring up the beast types lately. I've been getting pulled away for a lot of work at the castle, too. It's taken away from the job I'd rather be working at. The post office, you mean? They're so strong and cool, it seems like a waste to work at a job like that. I like it. It's nice to see the other villagers regularly. I like my boss, the work, and the atmosphere. It's very peaceful. Delivering mail is pretty fun and pleasant, too. I like the prince too, but sometimes the work can be very unpleasant. Yeah, I hear ya. The prince. I can't imagine what that guy's like. His harsh crackdown on witches and beast types! Can't, can't imagine he's any good! I think regardless of what kingdom we're in, it seems like there's always gonna be strict rules regarding witches and beast types. Isn't the prince just doing his job? Hmm. I just hope the world opens its eyes one day about how great witchcraft is. Outlawed or not, I'll always keep up with the practice. Personally, I find it very beautiful. People are just scared of it because they don't understand it. Such a shame. You know, I think you're very beautiful too. Flirting again. Hee <laughs> hee, you bet. But I do mean it, you know, you're really, di you're really different and special. It's a shame others don't always see that. It can't be helped. I know I'm pretty strange. Nobody really knows what I am. Even when I'm, even I'm scared of my own powers and strength. Like I said before, people who are, people are just scared of what they don't understand. Some of the villagers have warmed up to you lately. But they're starting to realize there's nothing to be afraid of. I guess that's why you like your job so much at the post office, huh? Yeah, that is a reason. Well, you know, we outcasts gotta stick together. Who cares if the rest of the world doesn't agree with us? 
I'll always have your back. Thanks, Claire. I know I can always count on you. The BFFs. Or maybe more, who knows. That was fun! Let's go again sometime! Yeah, let's do it again sometime soon. Hmm? More pages? More missing journal pages! What are these missing journal pages? I don't know... I don't know if I'm supposed to do something with them. That was fun, let's go again sometime. Yeah, let's do it again sometime soon. I don't know what to do with missing journal pages. Is there something I'm supposed to do with these? Do I do something with them in my journal? Oh, should I eat an apple? Oh, I forgot about these apples. They still seem good. I'll eat one later, though. Okay. Yes, let's record these journal pages. That's not how it is, is it? I don't need to change clothes. What I'm wearing right now is fine. I don't have... I don't know what to do now! I have no direct... Oh, no! Do I need to use the hint? I don't want to use the hint. I want to figure this out. The only thing I had to, I had planned for this episode was to go give Claire her thing. Except, she dropped me off and I got journal pages randomly. Like how I got them before. Okay, um... What if I go talk to, uh... Is it this robot girl? Is this the robot girl or is this someone else? This is the- Oh no, this is not the robot girl! Oh no, this is the postmaster! Or like, my boss! Do you want- Okay, let's go talk to the girl. I wanna go see what she's up to. Uh, what's her name again? It was, um... Something I kept thinking was an R, but it was an A instead. Yeah, she's right here. Hold on. Let's go see what she's up to. Maybe she's cool. I'm gonna deliver today. Last time we had a run-in with a beast type. Claire said this is so annoying, you can handle this, right? And without waiting for me to answer, she just flew off. She left me to fend off the beast type all by myself. I really- I barely made it out of that scrap alive. She's the worst. Now that does sound like her. Okay. Well, that didn't help. What do I do with journal pages? I don't know what to do with journal pages yet. What happens if I read her journal pages? This would be a manual for various machinery. Did you write this herself? I don't know. Okay, I guess right now all I can really do is head back to town. Oh yeah, there was that suspicious figure. I guess I should investigate that. That's what I can do. Okay. So I guess I'll, I'll go back to village, not town. Village has that mysterious figure that walked away. All the way back down. Oh, I guess I should... S oh, I already did... S oh, whatever, I'll do it again. No, not again! No! Alright, let's go. So, I saw the dude... Or, yeah, it was a dude, I'm pretty sure. Oh god, I can't... I can oh, oh god. Oh, oh my... Okay. Alright, we're here now. So... What do we do? What do we do? So the mysterious figure walked past here, right? <laughs> Saw someone with a very peculiar presence. Wonder where he was off to. Okay, so we'll walk over here and see if we can find him. What to buy? Okay, you don't have anything to say about it. Do you have a peculiar presence? My mom wanted me to pick up some stuff in the market, but... I don't know what I was supposed to get. Okay, well, I'm going to go over to... I don't I don't really know where I could possibly go to find this dude that just walked by. I would assume he's somewhere here. Maybe he's in one of these houses? Oh wait, wasn't I going to take this guy somewhere? Is this... Is, is there been a new day yet? I don't think so. I'm really known... Looking forward to seeing that nostalgic view on Scott. Okay, no, that's a future quest. Future quest, that's fine. Oh, I could actually rest here for free in the future. Oh, uh, yeah, I should talk to these guys after I deliver their mail. Maybe they all have something cool to say. I do kind of like how open-ended the game is. I mean, I do like it a lot. I just... Whenever they... I've, I've talked about this before, but open-ended games are kind of stressful for me to play blindly for YouTube because I get worried to have a whole episode of doing absolutely nothing. Which, uh... I mean, it's not entirely a bad thing, but... You know, it doesn't feel good. I'm so glad my stuff arrived in the mail. I was so worried that my family forgot to send these out. Or even worse, that it got lost in transit. Or that they're dead. Maybe that was the implication, though. Better late than never, right? Other villagers here feel the, feel the same. Oh, he's talking about everyone accepting me. 
Wait, that's not... Oh, wait, it was up here, right? This is the other mailbox? Okay, here it is. Who was in here? Who's this? Oh, are you the delivery girl? Thank you for delivering my mail earlier. It's arrived safe and sound. Okay, well, they're just really grateful. I don't even think I talked to her before. I didn't realize that was a different house entirely. Okay, well, um... Heading over to the castle? I want a lift? Uh... I don't know. Do I hold the, go to the castle now? Is that where that guy walked off to? I mean, I don't know where else to go. Alright, let's go. Oh look, it's going the other direction now. I just noticed the mouse. I don't know how long that was there for. Hopefully not for too long. Take care! Okay, so we're here now. Anything change here? I really don't know what to do. Should I talk to the chicken? I'm gonna talk to the chicken soon. I'm so tired. I could just wander aimlessly. But I'm trying to think that chicken's a good idea. Town Taylor. I didn't even realize there were signs all over here. These are really hard to see. Can't open a cafe near the village? Wait, there's a cafe near the village I haven't seen yet? Maybe I should go explore- maybe I should stop fast traveling for a bit and actually explore the areas in between. Let's go do that. To be- to buy honest. I remember this guy. He doesn't know how to English too good. Alright, so... It's over here. Wait, what is this? I don't think I've explored here. There's bats everywhere. There's a ghost! Okay. There's another ghost! Okay. There's a safe point! Right? What is this? Huh? How did... Okay, this is an important place that I haven't even checked at all. That ghost is approaching me. Hey, ghost! What's up? What's up, ghost? You got something to say? No? You're just gonna walk by me? Okay, that's cool, too. Okay, these guys are, uh... I don't think I stand a ghost of a chance if they choose to attack me. Get out of my way, ghost. That's very, this is very mysterious. I don't know why I'm making ghosts disappear, but I guess I'll just make them all disappear, because fuck it. Or at least the ones that want to talk. Why am I just not dot dot dotting all of these? Okay, let's just go over here. What is this? What? Treasure? Huh? There's something in here. A broken bottle. I see why it was left here. I'll just put it back. Broken bottle, huh? This treasure chest is sealed shut. I wonder what got trapped inside. Why are there just tra- There's no point in this. I'm not sure it's even meant for me anyway. Dude, there's so many- there's so many- I have several questions. What is this? A journal? Who does this belong to? Oh, is this the journal with the missing pages? It was a new morning. Everything was quiet and peaceful, except for the occasional beast types prowling about. Nothing out of the ordinary for this place. A place I wanted to stay for the rest of my life, I, I thought to myself. And then, it was as I was gathering something for breakfast, I saw someone crying. Someone this deep in the forest? Were they lost? I went to co take a closer look. A lone girl, crying all by herself. She looked to be maybe just a little bit younger than me. What was she doing here all by herself? Did she get separated from her parents? Did she have any parents? Should I help her? My instincts are telling me, don't get involved, and don't let anyone get involved with you. But what if she was like me? If she was all alone? This girl, could she survive in this forest all on her own? In the end, I decided to go and see if there was something I could do for her. I asked her, what are you doing here in the, in the forest all by yourself? Are you lost? My... my sister, I can't find her, the girl cried. She'd gone separated from her sister somehow, so this is her. This is, uh... This is, um... Ya... ya y Yuko? Yako? Oh my god, I can't remember her name now. It's been a... I, this is not the same recording session, so... Main character... But is that the... is that the hot demon dude? Well, all I had to do was help her find her sister, right? There's no way I could leave her alone while she's this lost and scared. At this rate, she'd be food for any wandering beast type. Look at that! Look at those eyes! It's dangerous here, I told her. I'll help you find your sister. As I helped her up, she seemed to calm down almost immediately. What's your name? I asked her. Yoki, Yoki, there we go. Yoki, she said. Okay, Yoki. Okay, Yoki. Okie dokie. Uh, let's check the nearby village. Maybe someone there might have seen where your sister went, I told her. And 
And so, we went to check the nearby village. But, it seemed like nobody had seen her sister. And nobody recognized this girl. The girl barely said anything at all, so I had to speak for her. Hours had passed, and still not even a hint about her sister's whereabouts. With no luck at the village, I decided maybe it was better to continue the search in the forest. This girl and her sister, were they travelers? Where did this girl come from? I tried to ask her, I tried to ask her but she wouldn't answer any of my questions. Actually, after I started t asking about her past, she collapsed. Did I push her too hard? It was getting late, and we were far from the village. So, I decided to take her back to the place I was staying at. It was a little run down, but it was better than having her sleep out here in the forest. I thought to myself, it will only be one night, and tomorrow I'll leave her with someone at the village. Someone like me. I don't know if I could really be of much help to her. Just when I thought my life would be easy and peaceful from here on out. This is... his journal. But... sister? How strange. Did I... have a sister? I'd like to read more. Continue reading? Yes. I have the missing journal pages, right? The new day soon arrived. As I was preparing for our commute to the village, I decided to try asking her about her sister one more time. Maybe before I drop her off at the village, and help, I'll help her look just a little bit more. But, when I asked her... Sister? I don't have a sister, she said. No way, I thought. Was this girl messing with me? I started to get upset. Or did she really forget? How could someone forget something like that? Well... There was no sense trying and trying to search for someone under these circumstances. Someone in the village will be able to do a better job than me with this. And so, we arrived at the village. I asked around, seeing if there was someone who could give her a place to stay. I found some people who seemed interested in helping her out. But, no matter where I dropped her off, she'd always find her way back to my place. Eventually, I stopped trying to leave her with someone in the village. It was more dangerous to have her wander back on her own than to just let her stay here. And so, as the days passed, the search for her sister would continue. But, she sure wasn't helpful in the search. She didn't know what she was looking for. During this time, while she was staying here, she would help out with things. She wasn't very good at helping, but... It was kind of nice to have company. I never looked after someone like this before. Maybe I wasn't so terrible at this as I thought. As time passed, I started to feel like we were family. Something I never thought I would have. But, I knew things couldn't stay this way. The terrifying past that follows me, I can't let her get caught up in it. If I was tracked all the way here... Well, in the meantime, maybe it's okay if things stay the way they are for now. Maybe they'll never find me, I thought. And so... Years would pass by. I would still try to look for clues about her sister. But also during this time, we grew up together as a family in this place. We started to fix up the house over time. It really began to feel like a real home. As time passed, I noticed something strange. I learned she was capable of magic, but it was unlike any magic I've ever seen. With this power, she was able to take on a large rampaging beast type, and she did it all by herself. I was worried. Was this a forbidden magic she's using? Was it witchcraft? But she hasn't studied any of the practices of witchcraft. Was she possibly a beast type? But she didn't look or act like a beast type. All I could think was, she needs to keep her powers of hers a secret. There's no way the crown here would leave her alone if she was found out. Isn't my power cool? Yoki, you have to promise me that you'll keep this power of yours a secret. Only use it when you are faced with immediate danger. What? Why? We don't know the origin of it, what kind of magic it is. And recently, I caught wind of something scary. I heard that the king and queen have died. I heard they were killed in a battle with a beast type. When the prince learned of this, he was devastated. I heard he's become wicked with hatred and bitterness. Any beast types found under his order, peaceful or not, are to be eliminated. I'm worried. If you display this power in front of her the wrong eyes, we'll consider you a beast type and the prince will have your head. Really? That's not what I've heard. I heard he's been intimidated by everything and cries every night. He's been too wimpy to succeed in the throne and doesn't leave his room. I'm not scared of that guy. Yoki, listen. It could be very serious if your people if people misinterpret your power. Please promise me that you won't use it in front of people. Fine, fine. I'll try to keep it a secret. I'm not really worried though. It was then my past finally caught up to me. Something more frightening than the prince or any beast type. 
I knew. There was no way things could last forever, but I really wanted to believe. I'll look for more pages. Too many pages are missing. Oh! A lot of spiders in- but wait, I still have that many pages missing? So that's the goal right now? I want to find all the journal pages by messing around. Should I try to go to sleep? Is that what I'm doing here? I don't know why there's a bunch of ghosts though, that's it's kinda confusing. Or why nothing- I guess I'm so powerful that no one ever wants to fight me, so I can just talk to them and disappear. I don't really know, I'm trying to figure that out still. But okay. Um, we haven't- now I know what to do with the missing journal pages. That's for- it's for that. I gotta like basically do things for people until I find all the journal pages. That's kind of like what- what it's- what it's sounding like right now. This is where the lakefront is. I gotta take the dude here later. Um, I should probably just take the shortcut back at home and try to sleep. It's the only thing I can really think of doing right now. Or, you know, talking to people involved in the story would also possibly be a, a lead, but I gotta figure this out on my own, I guess. Or talk to Chicken. Maybe the Chicken just tells me where to find journal pages. Quicker. Let's go. Cool. Alright, now I'm gonna go teleport over to home. And then try to sleep and see what happens. If that doesn't do anything, then I might just go talk to Chicken, honestly. I'm very aimless right now. Okay, let's see what happens if I try to sleep. Or just check my bed in general. I feel like it's been a pretty long day, all things considered, with all the walking I've been doing. Let's see here. It's my bed. Go to sleep? Yeah. I'm feeling pretty good about heading back to bed, but... Is there anything else I wanted to do? Should I sleep? Was there anything else I wanted to do? Oh, why do you gotta give me that? Oh, so you can miss stuff if you don't just check everything. But I'm pretty sure I checked everything pretty thoroughly, and now tomorrow I can go do my... Do stuff like, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna do it. No, there's no no FOMO, alright? No FOMO. We're gonna sleep. He's, he's feeling pretty good, which means that's probably a hint that um, I did a lot of things. Whatever it was, I'll just do it tomorrow. I'm beat? Yeah, okay. I probably missed something. That was probably a hint that I missed something. Oh well. Oh no! Did that end the game? Am I just supposed to do as many things as I can before I go to sleep? Because I want to do the thing tomorrow. What? No! No, we're not doing that. No. No. <laughs> That's not how we're ending things here, okay? We're not just gonna go to sleep and nothing happens. So do I never get to take that guy to the freaking... I need to finish the journal. That's what I need to do. This is literally a game where you can just do whatever the hell you want. And I, I, what I want... Okay, I'm gonna go talk to the chicken. I'm not going to sleep. Sleep is death. Sleep is actual death. We don't do that here. We don't die sleeping. We die winning. I don't... I remember there was another chicken somewhere, but I forgot where it was, so I'm just gonna go back to the one that I know. Oh, that was dumb. Mm-hmm. Although that, those seeing those credits made me really sad. Because then I remember this game is probably going to end soon. It's not, a, it's not a very long game. That's a good sign though that I really like this game. Did I not see this guy? Oh, it's you! I've known you since you were very little. I've been watching you over the years. You've grown so much and look so much more tasty. I think I remember you. I don't recall you ever wanting to eat me though. I thought you were a more peaceful beast type. I am peaceful. I won't eat anything that's alive. I only eat what's already dead. Ah, so you're a scavenger. I've been waiting for you to die ever since I laid my eyes on you. I can't wait for that day. Don't look so enthusiastic. The man who visits you, he also looks so tasty. Are you talking about Zara? Did I not see him just standing here the whole time? Or did that only come because I loaded my save point? After sleeping. I really don't know. Chirp. Chirp. Are you feeling lost? Confused? I'm here to help. Yes, give me a hint. Did you take a look at the pretty scenic view north of your house? Yeah, I did. Do you have another hint for me? Okay, hold on. Really? That's my hint? My hint is to just go here? Oh. What? 
I could have interacted with the scenery this whole time. Okay. Nice. That was pretty. What? That's it? You just want to tell me to check out the scenery because you really wanted me to see the art? You know what? I respect that. That art's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Okay, now will you give me a new hint now? This guy disappeared! So he just randomly shows up whenever he feels like it? So I guess there are just random stuff you can just miss. Chirp, chirp. I am feeling lost. Did you check out the tree stump deep in the forest surrounded by many animals? I did not. Let's go check that out. Surrounded by many animals, huh? That sounds really familiar, like I should have seen it. Well, time to explore, everybody. Clearly, I did not explore enough. How long is this going to be for me? I technically just beat the game and then continued. Deep in the forest, deep in the forest. Tree stump, deep in the forest, surrounded by many animals. I want to see everything this game has to offer. Who knows when it's, how long it's going to be until there's another Temi Chan game. This one's not surrounded by... Oh, what's this? Oh, wait, well, yeah, this is the corner with, uh, Wolf Girl. Who's probably still passed out, right? To be honest, she's the kind of beast type the prince would get rid of. She's a dangerous type that will violently attack anyone, but... I feel like she's not really what she seems. I should keep her existence a secret from the prince. She never wandered close to the village, and she only seems interested in attacking me for some reason. Better leave. I don't want to stick around for when she wakes up. I do. I want to see what she's up to. Crazy wolf girl. Alright, well the stump is not here. As far as I know right now, I am absolutely stumped. And where the stump is. Let's find it though, somehow. This one? It's not a stump though. I do remember seeing this letter though, and there's nothing I can do with it still. There are so many questions I have, and I don't even know if I can do everything in this game. Okay, you're not a helpful chicken. Like, I don't know if this is like a demo or something now that I think about it. I don't really even uh, confirm that. Is everything doable? Like, can I do everything in this game? Or is it just because it, like, I can't I can't take that guy to the, the lakefront? Because if I go to sleep, the game ends. And he said he wanted to do that tomorrow. So, like, is that just not a thing I can do? Okay. I still want to find the stump, though, deep in the forest. I am pretty deep in the forest right now, aren't I? Guess I didn't go in this direction, did I? Is there something here that I missed? It looks like there is. Oh, yeah! I definitely missed something here! Alright, here's something that I entirely missed. Let's go. What's over here? There's three paths to take. So this way goes here. We got this guy. Howl. Well, how old do you do? What the hell is this? Mysterious guys! Are you guys lost? We're pretty deep in the forest. Nope. We're doing just fine. Are you sure? Pretty far from anywhere. Yep. That's strange. I can't sense a fountain anywhere. Fountain? Who are these guys? Who are these guys now? What? How many places are there to explore that I haven't been checking out? You know what? 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 Who's this? He's gone. There's a pathway over here too. Here's the here's a stump. Surrounded by animals. You know what guys? I don't know what the hell's gonna happen next, but you know what? I feel like I probably should end the episode here. I'm just going to go back to that save point and properly explore this without feeling like I'm rushing because I'm near the end of the episode. So, yeah, looks like we do have some stuff to do. We are not going to go to sleep. That was a trap. We ain't sleeping. I want, I'm want. i actually legitimately curious to see what happens, what other things there are. I want to see more about the backstory. We're going to find everything there is before we go to sleep, okay? That's just how it's going to be. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, please leave a like down below. It helps me a lot. And I hope you guys all have a great day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya!